Hi, and welcome to Enchantment of Eternity's Game of Thrones Season 6 predictions video on who's going to meet up. So this video is a last minute add-on to a series of videos I made predicting what will happen in Season 6 of Game of Thrones. I'm making this video four days before the Season 6 uh, premiere airs, so very last minute on this one. Uh, so it's been said by a lot of people involved with the show, including the showrunners and actors, that Season 6 will see a lot of characters come together and meeting who haven't met each other previously, even more so than in Season 5. So in this video, I'm going to attempt to predict uh, which uh, established characters who have not previously met each other will share the screen together in Season 6. So I have to start off by giving a spoiler warning for Game of Thrones up to Season 5, as well as spoiler warning for filming and production leaks for Season 6. If you don't want to know anything about what's been confirmed for season six then this video may not be for you so this was a tough one in which I really had to rack my brain and all you know although there have been a lot of quotes um, from those involved uh, with the show to indicate a lot of characters will be meeting who haven't met before let me quote the one that really got me thinking and that's from writer Brian Cogman who had this to say there's a trend that began in Season 5 and continues even more so this season of worlds colliding, with characters meeting in hopefully very unexpected ways. So I'm going to try to predict which characters uh, who've appeared on the show before, uh, but never actually shared the screen together, uh, will meet up in Season 6. So let me start my first prediction, which is a group one, featuring some characters who have met each other and some characters who haven't, but I believe all of these characters will meet one another this season. So that is Jon Snow, Davos, Melisandre, Sansa, Rickon, Osha, Brienne, and Podrick. So it is my prediction that Sansa will take on uh, Brienne as her personal guard after Brienne saves her life from the Bolton soldiers at the start of the season. And together with her faithful squire Podrick, they will encounter Rickon and her, uh, his protector Osha and will try to rally the north uh, against the Boltons and that eventually will lead uh, them to Jon Snow accompanied by Davos and Melisandre will also meet up with this group uh, to rally the north to their calls. Now I you know I could get this one partially right and maybe you know not all of these people will meet each other but at the moment I'm sticking with all of these people. Uh, there's speculation that Rakan might be in the hands of Ramsey, but I don't particularly buy into that at the moment, but I could be wrong. And we do know that Brienne and Podrick will be in the Riverlands towards the end of the season. However, I'm still predicting that they're going to stick around the north long enough to meet Jon Snow and Davos, but we'll just have to see. What's interesting in this group, though, is uh, the Stark reunion with Jon Snow, Sansa, and Rickon, which I believe will happen, or at the very least, Jon Snow and Sansa. However, the two of them do know each other in the, con in the lore of the show, so we just haven't seen it on screen before. So I think uh, that will be really interesting to see. However, it's possible that two people's meeting in this group that I mentioned was already foreshadowed in the trailers, and that is Davos and Sansa, because many theorize that the shot we see of Davos in the trailer and the shot we see of Sansa in the trailer are at the same location on Bear Island and that Davos and Sansa traveled there together. But we will see about that. So my next prediction is along those same lines is Sansa will meet Tormund Giant Spain. Now I didn't include Tormund in the previous group because I don't think he'll meet everyone there. Like I don't think he'll meet Brienne and Podrick and probably not Rakan and Osha, but I do believe he will meet Sansa at some point which will be uh, an unexpected pairing. Uh, we do know the Wildlings, including Tormund, will fight with the Starks against the Boltons, and with Sansa being one of the main Starks, I think it makes a lot of sense for 
these two to meet at some point, which would be quite a change of pace. Uh, as thus far, Tormund has been pretty isolated from the rest of the storylines in the show, so it would be really interesting to see him interact with someone typically associated with the South. Sticking to uh, the North, my next prediction is Jon Snow, Ramsay, and Littlefinger will meet. Now this has pretty much been rumored by filming leaks that a scene takes place in Winterfell with Jon Snow, Ramsay, Littlefinger, and Sansa. Of course, I didn't include Sansa in this group because she has already met uh, Ramsay and Littlefinger and I already talked about her and Jon Snow meeting. Of course, Ramsay and Littlefinger already met each other last season, but neither one has met Jon Snow yet. Uh, so this would be a first. Although I'm not sure um, the validity of the leaks that the scene takes place anymore, but even you know, if um, that isn't the case, I think it's very likely that these three will run into each other at some point. Jon Snow and Ramsay being, uh, you know, heads of opposing sides of the Battle of Bastards, it seems uh, very apt for the two of them to share the screen at some point. And there are rumblings that Littlefinger will be involved in there somewhere as well, so I'm predicting that he will be involved in this meeting as well. So moving on to other regions, uh, but getting back to Brienne, my next pick is Brienne and Blackfish Tully. We heard from leaks a while ago that Brienne would be at River Run, and from that shot in the trailer, it does look like she will be inside of River Run, so it's my guess that she will actually meet with Brendan Blackfish Tully. In fact, it is my prediction that Brienne will be sent to River Run by Sansa, and so she will meet with the Blackfish on her behalf, but that is just my guess. So my next guest, also in the Riverlands, is Jamie and Walder Frey. Although this isn't too much of a stretch seeing the alliance uh, the Freys have with the Lannisters. And from these shots in the trailers, we don't actually see Jamie and Walder together, but we see Walder toasting a bunch of Lannister soldiers at the twins. So I, you know, I don't find it very far-fetched to guess that Jamie travels to the twins where he meets with Walder Frey. So my next prediction, and this one is uh, one that I just came up with, is Theon, Yara, Daenerys Targaryen, and Tyrion Lannister. The funny thing is Tyrion and Theon had already met and they shared the screen together in season one under different circumstances, but that was Winterfell, whereas I'm thinking season six, it will be in Marine. Now, that may seem quite out there to predict that Theon will make it all the way to Marine. as last we saw him, he was jumping off the castle walls of Winterfell, but we've heard already that Theon will be in the Iron Islands later this season, so it's well known he reconnects with his sister Yara. And in the trailer, we see Yara making out with this woman who, it's been pointed out to me, bears a teardrop tattoo, which identifies her as a prostitute from Volantis. So it's safe to bet that Yara is in Volantis. Uh, so then I'm jumping to the far off conclusion is that the reason she's in Volantis is because she's on her way to Marine. And that she's the reason why she's on her way to Marine is because she is part of a storyline similar to the books where the Ironborn try to form an alliance with the Neris. However, in the case of the show, I believe that Yara is traveling with Euron and Theon Greyjoy and they will go to Marine to find Daenerys, has returned from her stint with the Dothraki, and there they will meet with Daenerys and her advisor, Tyrion. But that's just my wild guess, we'll see. So speaking of Tyrion and Daenerys, I have two more predictions, both are kind of really far-fetched, and I don't really jive with the one I just made, but I made these predictions in my original prediction series, so I thought I would repeat them here, although I'm really uncertain of their likelihood. The first is Daenerys and Prince Duran. I do think this meetup is bound to happen eventually, but many would think that this season is too soon, and Daenerys will not step foot in Westeros this season 
I still believe that she will, and I believe that it will be in Dorne to meet an ally ready and waiting in Prince Duran Martel. Uh, it may not be too soon, particularly with the news that Dan and Dave believe that there are only 13 episodes worth of stories left after season 6, and that so that makes me think that season 6 might move a bit quicker than some people suspect. And the other unlikely pair-up uh, along those same lines is Tyrion and Samwell Tarly. Whereas I predicted uh, Daenerys would go to Dorne, I predicted that Tyrion would split from her and go to Old Town instead on a quest to find Maester Marwyn, where he would instead encounter Samwell Tarly. Now this is probably my most far-fetched one yet, and to be honest, I'll be simply amazed if I actually get this one right, as I fully expect not to. However, I do think Samwell does need to meet up with some established character this season, but at this point I can't really think on who that may be. So I'm going to throw it out there that it will be Tyrion, but mark my word, if it isn't Tyrion, it's going to be someone. So, since I went so far-fetched, let me end this video on an easy one. Uh, in fact, I can't even call it a prediction because it was already confirmed by the trailers, and that is Bran and the Night King, which we see them right there together. Now, some may not actually call that meeting, since obviously it's a vision of some sort as Bran is standing in the scene, but I do believe it is the actual mind of Bran actually meeting the actual mind of the Night King. Even if they're not in the same physical location, I do believe it's not like a dream or other fake reality. I believe that they're actually meeting each other. So that's it for my Game of Thrones Season 6 prediction video on who's going to meet up. Uh, we're only mere days away from Season 6 starting and I'll be doing weekly episode reviews on my channel as soon as I can get them out and I will also be doing weekly episode discussion videos with my brother from the YouTube channel at Kentomco. We will alternate each week uh, from his channel to my channel our discussion videos but our first one will be on my channel for episode one so make sure you subscribe so you can keep up with all of that and thanks a lot for